Now I am going to do the reactivity of metal with acid. For this part we have the copper, this is A, we have magnesium, B, we have zinc, C and this is hydrochloric acid. I already labeled these three test tubes A, B and C. Now I am going to take little pieces of copper turnings into A. bit of magnesium into B a pinch of zinc into C now I'm going to add 10 to 15 drops of hydrochloric acid in all the test tubes A with copper it looks there is like you know no change with the copper you can record onto your data sheets this is magnesium with hydrochloric acid you can see the bubbles this is zinc with hydrochloric acid you see at the bottom you can see the effervescence and the bubbling you can record these changes onto your data sheets